Okay, so we are back again. Um, this time I'm going to show you something that is missing in uh, in Linux in most distributions today, and that is a screensaver. Uh, if you are using like GNOME or uh, like me you will notice there is no screensaver available in in uh, in the system you can go here you can go in your settings and you will see here that you can go to displays and there's nothing here I have two displays as you can see if you go to power here you can see that it's uh, nothing here so for f to get a screensaver you can actually use something called X screensaver that is actually been the default software for uh, for Linux before and uh, it's actually working pretty good so what you need to do is to install X screen saver on your on your system and uh, to do this we have a terminal here I am using arc as you all know maybe so like in in my case uh, after you installed X screen saver on your uh, system you need to you need to uh, to start X screensaver because if you don't start it it will it will not run automatically you can also do a script or a startup for this so it will start automatically when you go inside gnome so for this you will have to add something i will show you so if you are recording uh, let me see here we will go in startup applications here you can see all the software that I have that I automatically start up here you see I added X screen saver that means that this one will start direct when my gnome session start but to accomplish this you also need to make a uh, a um, a link so to speak so it will start automatically and that is pretty easy I will show you okay so if you open uh, your your uh, Nautilus here your file browser you will go inside dot local when you go inside uh, dot local you will see share go inside share you will see applications here you can see I have a lot of of links and I will also have a file called xscreen.desktop I can open this one with the text editor and you can see here how how I uh, made my my link um, what will happen with this one is you will create a, a desktop icon and um, so you just add this to a file inside home.local share and applications and then you will open the uh, gnome Twix uh, and you add X screen saver as your uh, uh, startup application that means that every time gnome or your desktop that you environment that you are using will start uh, it will start automatic but this is this is for gnome because I'm using gnome so that's how that one works and as you can see here there are many kinds of uh, over screen savers that you can uh, that you can choose from 
and I will also show you how how does it look okay so if we go inside uh, the X X uh, screen sa savers minus settings you will come inside uh, the settings and here as usual uh, as with all screen savers you can choose here what kind of screen saver you want and you see there's a list of many I have chosen the gear matrix because I think it's kind of cool and then you can choose here how many minutes you want to choose before it turns blank and you can also uh, go inside here and choose power management uh, many time types of uh, settings here uh, if you want but I have only chosen this GL matrix and I set to 10 minutes I think that's that's uh, okay for me okay so that is pretty much it it's pretty easy straightforward if you want to if you want to have a screen saver uh, on your uh, on your system I know that the reason behind that they have uh, removed uh, this from from uh, from gnome or in Linux overall is because it's a they think it's just a waste of uh, of, of power so to speak in your system but maybe you want to enable it and now you know how and yeah, as you can see here again it is a long list of many kinds of screen savers so you will actually find something that it's uh, pretty cool and uh, works works for you okay so below here I will put uh, the instructions again uh, where to go and how to uh, how to enable it on your uh, on your system uh, and this is particularly then for gnome okay so thank you for watching see you again bye